Hey friends, hey family. Como estas? Bienvenidos. We're back with another video. And of course, today's video for May Monday, y'all, is a... I had to take a TJ Maxx run. I'm going to show you guys what I got in terms of organization, in terms of home things, but most importantly, the hair stuff. We got to like see and shop for discount hair products, y'all. And let me just say that I am loving going to TJ Maxx to Marshalls to all of these places that have different hair care products and we're giving it a shot I saw something y'all I had like a, I had a basket load of things I had to like I was like girl but you yeah I needed to some shoe I needed some shoes I'm not gonna show the fashion things y'all not interested in that if you are let me know but in today's video we are going to get into it and and if you had not hit the subscribe button already y'all go ahead and do it if you knew okay if you're an OG okay and you watch me and you had subscribed yeah girl why why I would love for you guys to be a part of the Missy Q family over here because the tribe is live yes and hit the notification bell it's gonna let you know when I drop a video because y'all I let me just say life has been crazy so the uploads have been like unpredictable but I usually post them at 6 p.m. Monday Wednesday and Friday and Sundays at 2 p.m. for courageous conversations if you don't know what that is check it out I think you're gonna like it but in today's video we are going to show you guys what I hauled from TJ Maxx I do have a fall haul coming but I felt like that this was uh, a little bit more fun to do because we shopped at Marshall's the last time this time is TJ Maxx and home goods so without further ado let's get into the video okay I'll leave links down below for anything that I find online DW your home uh, candles they do have an Instagram page and it's so beautiful yes but anything else uh, I am talking about my jewelry in this and um, that's the first part of the segment but let's jump right into what a sister got at TJ Maxx and home goods okay, so the first thing I'm going to show you guys before I get into here is this amazing organizer and I got this for my jewelry okay so I actually started my jewelry business y'all it's called the Queen's Vault okay Missy Q gems on Instagram I definitely will leave a link down below but I have started my jewelry business yes and um, this is where I'm keeping all of my pieces but I also have some pieces to share with you guys I'm going to be doing Facebook lives and Instagram lives and you can actually purchase some of these on your own of course you can kind of see that it's paparazzi so paparazzi is just the label but my store will be the brand of all the things that I have in there so like this piece is from paparazzi so um, a beautiful brass copper uh, piece and these are like earrings the set y'all five dollars well these are separate earrings these are actually the earrings let me see this is how everything looks. I kind of categorized them. I have rings. I have like my pearls. I mean, I am so in love with the jewelry line, but let's talk about the organizer. Okay. So this organizer came from TJ Maxx and um, actually the home good side. And um, so it's pretty little things and I can hang it up just because y'all these statement pieces can get rather big but I love like this one came in here like it fits but some of these that are not bendable and are big can go into the bottom so I still have some more pieces to fill I love the fact that I can separate them um, these are like my little small chains you know that I have and I also have some it has the earrings with it I'm really excited about this I will link information down below where you guys can shop my store and all things five dollars need I say more most of the things five dollars because they have some really nice exclusive pieces that are a little bit more but for the most part everything is five dollars but anyway this was $12.99 and it zips all the way across but it also has sections so how cute is that this is the only thing I got I wish I would have gotten 
um, I couldn't I can't do a jewelry box right now I'm trying to like keep the spaces and the lines in my bedroom very clean and things off the top of it besides like I think I'm gonna have a makeup vanity and everything and an ottoman I'm just very trying to make this very nice and serene so I'm trying to keep things off of the top of the counters which is extremely hard but anyway, I'm rambling. Let's get into the meat of this, which is for Main Monday, and those are my hair products. Oh, please. Let's talk about something that I've had and I love, and I would consider it a holy grail because I love the shampoo so much. It is the Shea Moisture Strengthen and Restore Shampoo. This has shea butter, peppermint, and apple cider vinegar. I think in terms of apple cider vinegar rinse or something to really pull out the... Um, the debris and the impurities out of off the scalp and off the hair this was really really good actually my husband really liked this too so I repurchased this and from Marshall's this is $6.99 so obviously it's not like the $11.99 $12.99 that you would pay in the store so hence the reason why I paid half so check for Shea Moisture that's one of the brands that I have been seeing in Marshall's and TJ Maxx and Ross those type of stores check the beauty aisle the home um, yeah the beauty aisle and you might find something that you like okay this is something that's new to me that I did not see from on Jackie's before are the oils have y'all seen this this one is called balance this is grape seed and avocado oil which my hair loves both of these I wish that this was larger this is a four ounce bottle and you can use it as it says uh, enriched with coconut improves per porosity level and moisture balance excellent pre-poo treatment so improves porosity level i guess depending on what products that you put in your hair it can change the ph balance of your scalp your hair and uh, i guess that's what it's alluding to but um it says that you can use this as a pre-poo um, I'm going to use it as a pre-poo and as um, a massage to my massage into my scalp on my scalp. I love that it has a spout where you can put it straight on there. Let's see. The cap is closed. So this would be my first time even opening. I want to see if it has a fragrance to it. Oh, it has a pleasant it smells uh, very it says smells kind of citrusy but I'm excited to try this we will see it says it's a growth oil but you know I'm kind of skeptical skeptical about growth oils but not to say they don't work I think it's a combination of things okay so anyway this is what I was most excited to try oh by the way this growth oil was $3.99 from TJ Maxx this is from the beauty side so this is not um this the organizer was from the home goods section the candles that i'm gonna show you are from the home goods section this is from the beauty section of tj maxx so there's a home goods side and then there is a tj maxx side which is the fashion and beauty and everything but anyway this is from the beauty side um jamaican black castor oil by sunny isle this is the leave-in not free forever detangler and conditioner with jamaican black castor oil it is paraben and sulfate free and um this i wanted to try so badly because it says that this thing is supposed to really detangle your hair so we will see you can use this as a detangler or you can use it as a leave-in and um, i think i'm going to use it as a let's see a water propylene glycol cetyl alcohol BTMS, coconut oil, castor seed oil. This one does have a silicone in it, you guys. We'll see how this works and I can come back in a haul report and let you guys know. But this was $5.99, okay? I've never seen Sunny Isle have a leave-in conditioner. Never saw them have a deep conditioner, y'all. Let me know. Have y'all heard about this? This is the Jamaican Black Castor Oil Intensive Repair Mask damage reversal formula it stimulates hair growth uh, okay hydrates uh damaged hair brittle hair excellent for all hair types i don't know because it says in all hair types i guess hair types not porosities because i don't know it has coconut oil linseed oil grapeseed oil safflower or oil 
and it has wheat protein. This might not be good for people who are protein sensitive. Um, I am going to do a video about that, but let's see. It does smell good and it looks like cottage cheese, but it has a lot of movement. This may work, you guys. We will see. I did purchase this for, let's see how much I paid for. Where's the tag? Hmm. Maybe she must have paid, I, she must have put it as $5.99 because it didn't have a tag and she must have ran this twice. Okay, so $5.99 for this from TJ Maxx and that's not bad for a deep conditioner and you get 16 ounces of product. This one you get 8 ounces, I want to say. Yes. So we will try these and come back in a haul report. I'll probably use that in my next wash day and let's move on to candles. I'm not purchasing candles as much as I did before I was just purchasing them like oh, I was like crazed like everybody else with Bath and Body Works but I have found a true love for like a certain brand of candles and it is from WD wait DW home I'm sorry this is the light this is richly scented candle this is hand poured and I love it that it gives the burn time this one will burn for 60 approximately 56 hours this is the pumpkin donut and it smells so good I like to shop for my candles seasonally that's one of the things that I've learned about myself is you know when I'm not in Bath and Body Works. Not to say that I won't buy a Bath and Body Works candle anymore because I love pumpkin pecan waffles. My husband loves that scent. But I wanted to get something different. This one is pumpkin donut. It smells so good. I smell the pumpkin and definitely the sweetness. I am one that I've learned I like sophisticated sweet and I like sophisticated like woodsy. Okay. So pumpkin donut. The next candle that I have because I feel like for fall three candles would get me through fall okay these burn pretty well and the scent even after you burn them stays in the room this one is richly scented this is wood fire apple I had a huge wood fire apple last year this is a two wick and I love don't you just love that this looks very very festival I can smell the smoke and I definitely can smell the apple of this this is one of my favorite candles from DW Home and then I picked up another one now this one is pretty big this one's gonna take me into winter but that's okay because I really really like this one so if you are a fan of the of the warm tobacco pipe um, my girl CJ got me on to that that candle and it is amazing I love it so much I was uh, so tempted to get that and then um, I tried this one this is pumpkin and bourbon this is um, this is uh, let's see the 25.4 ounces and it says it's pumpkin puree blended with brown sugar and a dash of rich bourbon this smells so good and I love that first of all you can use this as a coaster but I love that it has pumpkin and bourbon it smells so good it's one of those sweet rich like sophisticated if you like warm tobacco pipe but you want something a little bit more desserty sweet if you want something that's going to burn in your kitchen oh I can't wait till I get like a nice rustic I want to have a rustic type of um, kitchen and I can so see this being like burned okay I purchased this for I took the price off I think this was $12.99 this one was $7.99 and this one I believe is $6.99 okay but this is gonna take me through fall I know in the back what is burning is the I want to say lemon mint leaf from Bath and Body Works I'm trying to get through that one kind of like was a spring but because of the eucalyptus and the mint you can still get away with it going into fall so that one's like a transition candle but I am excited about what I've gotten organ organization wise don't forget to check out my link down below for my store and if you want to shop any and see anything just check it out y'all I thought like oh I was like whatever that's five dollar jewelry y'all this stuff is nice okay and it looks better even better in person than what it looks like on the website 
and it looks fine on the other side but it looks even better when you get it so i'm loving these pieces i'm trying to share in the love you guys y'all love when i share different things so i'll let you know that um this is again what i am panning the anastasia world traveler palette this is a look that I think I'm going to post on my second channel, Missy Q Memoirs. I hope you guys are enjoying it. Let me know if you like videos like this. And definitely I will come back in a haul report. Let you know what are like favorites and flops. Um, whether I like it or not. Because I think it's important to let y'all know what sticks around. Or what kicks the bucket in my opinion. So I thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe if you hadn't already. I'll see you in the next video. Adios.